All right, today we're gonna be reacting to a weird video by Cut. I don't know why this is even a video. Um, maybe they were just running out of ideas. Right here, how gay are you? <laughs> I know a couple people that'd be a straight 10 because of how sus they be. On a scale of one to 10, how gay are you? Two. Why do you say two? Cause uh, Ryan Reynolds. <laughs> yeah, I guarantee there's a lot of straight guys who can agree with me on that. Nah, boy, you gay, bro. <laughs> I don't know why, but like, there's always those memes, and there's always dudes like talking about like um certain uh famous people that are like you know what, not bad looking at all. Like it's not. I don't think it's sexuality is gay to say anything it's like sad. that. But On a scale of one to ten, one being somebody's attracted to, to attract to I guess very gay. Where do you fall on the spectrum? My mom will see this. How gay am I? That's a good question. Hmm. Mm. Is it a really? Is it okay. a good question? How gay are you? Zero, unfortunately. Zero. 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 Yes. Yeah, bro, zero. What the hell? What do you think this is? I'm a one. One? <laughs> I'm straight. When did you know you were straight? I think as soon as I was cognizant. I always knew that I liked girls. I've like thought about it just because my mom's gay and she always asked me like, are you sure? Are you sure you're not gay? And I'm like, no, mom. What the hell? That's fucking crazy, bro. The fact that your parent presses on you. The fact that your parent even pressing was like, are you gay? Are you gay? Are you gay? What kind of shit is that, bro? Like... If your kid is gay, they're gay. But if they're straight, they're straight. Like, don't fucking push something onto somebody else. It's fucking weird. Nah. I've just always been only attracted to women. I mean, I've had a moment of questioning it. I was just like, it's not my thing. Hell no. Nah. <laughs> Some guys, I'm like, three point oh, five. I have no romantic feel. No, nah, I don't think that's. You can, you could, you could see a dude and be like, yeah, nah, that dude is objectively, you know, a good-looking person. You know what I mean? But it won't necessarily mean you're gay. You know when somebody, you know, is objectively good looking, you know what I mean? If they're fit, you know what I mean? Chisel jawline, you know what I mean? Just, you can tell when somebody's objectively attractive. Like, oh, this is probably what women are like, you know, that dude is attractive. It's, it's a lot different if you start looking at other things. Feelings? I mean, there's a little like, oh man, like if I was a girl, I would bang you. 1.5. What no, the fuck? Okay. Now that's some shit you wouldn't say. You could say some other dude looks all right. Objectively, bro. You're attractive, man. Uh, that's what other women would probably find attractive. But if you're like, if I was a girl, nah, nah, bro. That's that's pretty sus, man. That's like, yeah, that guy was right. He is a 3.5. Two and a half, maybe three. Two and a half. I like a two and a half, three. I'm not against it. I still need to maybe try to explore my sexuality, see what I like. Right now, I feel like I'm okay with what I am. <laughs> Describe your sexuality. Holy shit. For everybody, but I'm straight. I'm straight. 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 I'm pretty sure a majority of people on this planet are straight. A good majority. Straight. Straight. Skater men. <laughs> That's pretty much it. Straight? Question mark. <laughs> straight curious. I've been questioning a bit, like curious. if I was like bisexual or straight or stuff like that. Do I want to just be that pretty girl or do I want to be with that pretty girl? It's really hard to tell sometimes. I've kissed a girl, but she was my best friend and it was at a party and there was alcohol and- Did you like it? Uh, no. I'm generally pretty straight. I haven't gone for any guys or anything. I'm open, I'm not, I'm not, I don't, Sides or anything. I identify as straight, but <laughs> the first shit. person. Uh, my bad if I'm my bad if I'm laughing. That's it's just that's pretty fucking gay, you know. <laughs> You're open to it, bro. <laughs> I think of when it's I not wrong with that. I guess. Crush is Zendaya. At all? Would you kiss her? Though? Um, yeah. Why not, Zendaya? If you're out there, I'd kiss you. What the hell? You can admit if somebody looks good, right? But it's only when you start doing certain actions, then it becomes, you know, not straight. You know what I mean? Like she could say that Zendaya looks good. And it won't be gay. But she says Zendaya looks good, and if she would kiss her, she'd kiss her, then yeah, that's pretty good. Which is nothing wrong with that, but I'm just I'm just saying what it is. I think everyone is a little gay. I'd say I'm at like a three. I like acknowledge that like guys can be attractive. I just don't like penises. And from the girls I've- Yeah, that's what I'm saying. If you can acknowledge a dude is attractive, okay. But it doesn't mean you're gay, bro. This man give him skating, uh, a fucking, this man give himself a rating of like three, bro. You're like a zero, dog. Admitting a dude looks good isn't gay, all right. But- you know what I mean? If you take it a step further to one and you start liking a little too much, then uh, yeah, that, that that does become. I talk to you, they don't like them either. So maybe I am gay. I don't know. What <laughs> the fuck? Four right now. I love I love the people that they got. They get a lot of young people, and they're all so open. I guess a lot of young people tend to be more open minded about that shit. Yeah, that's not my it's not my road. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, we're straight here. Sure, it's based on who I'm interested in, and I think that's what it should be about in general. Describe your sexuality. 
I'm bisexual. Bisexual? Bisexual, for now. I guess bisexual. It's just kind of if I have that connection with a person, I don't really care what comes with that. I just think I love who I love. I do like boys more than I do like girls. I like girls more. <laughs> I'd put myself at like a five. I'd say a good five. I'm like kind of right in the middle because I don't know who I am yet. You got time. Yeah. Probably like a six. Seven. Why like a seven? Men are sticky. Seven or eight. My sexuality. <laughs> um, gay? I love how her reasoning is why she likes girls and doesn't like dudes is because we're sticky. <laughs> Simple, but I guess if it's effective for you to not like dudes, I guess. It'd be the best year, so I Weird. really came to understanding, like, I think I'm asexual. Once I did figure that out, I like felt like I discovered it, you know? Like I knew that's what I was. I think asexual is just not being sexually attracted to anything. I'm not sure. I don't know. I have no idea. I don't really know. Don't really think about it. Non-labeled asexual, maybe? I'll probably know when the time comes. It's all Interesting generation that I live in now. Everybody got so bored and life got so much more easier that people started making problems up. Like the whole sexuality problem, bro. I don't think nothing, none of that shit matters, bro. You can give yourself whatever label you want. But I guess old people are so opposed to it. I don't know. I don't really care. I don't know. People can do whatever the fuck they want. People have been doing whatever the fuck they wanted for centuries. And goddamn, since the start of mankind, people do whatever the fuck they want. Obviously, you know, when I feel like when there's society and civilizations involved, and there's certain societal standards that get made up. Which is why this is even a problem, which is not actually a problem, but it is. It's really weird. It's really weird to like look at it the way I'm looking at it, but I guess an old guy would be like, no, oh no, gay is bad. And then uh, younger generations are like, no, it's okay. <sighs> but I guess younger generations are a lot more of, a lot more open, I guess. I don't, I don't know if it's going to change in the future, if it's going to revert back to older times where... People aren't really about that kind of stuff, you know what I mean? Or maybe societies and civilizations will collapse and, you know, societal standards will change once again. Because over this, you know, over the centuries, over time, things change a lot, you know what I mean? Some things that were good end up becoming bad and some things that were looked down upon and looked bad end up becoming good, you know? It's just kind of how society kind of rules with, you know? People go with what the majority think, you know? If majority people think this is bad, if people think, you know, being gay is bad, if that's a majority of people, that will end up being the majority outlook. But if the majority of people, which my younger generations, our, I guess in my generation, people are like, ah, if you're that, you're this, whatever, nobody cares in this generation. I, I started listening cool. to Billie Eilish when I was like 14, and then I was like, she's really, really, Damn. really hot. What's your How old are you? What the fuck? She said when she was 14, how old are you? Like 18? Why you look like you're 20 something? Look, she looks old as hell. Really? Okay, not really that really old, but What's she looks example? older. Alright, well, that's it for the video. That was interesting to see. <laughs> Fucking, uh, I guess, kids close, around my age, talking about on a gay scale, fucking 0 to 10. That was kind of funny. I mean, um, that's cool, though. I mean, as long as there's no hate, you know what I mean? As long as nobody's taking a shit on another person about, you know, who they are. You know, as long as everybody can coincide together and be happy. I think that's what matters. Anyways, drop a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.